Hello there. Hi! I'm Pizza Lord, also known as Jess. This is weird. Welcome to my YouTube channel! I'm really not like that, I promise. So you'll probably see lots of vlogs of me going on about my boring life and unfortunate events I've been going through. <laughs> Sorry. But I'm sure, well, I hope that it will be entertaining for you guys. Yeah, I possibly might be doing some gaming later on the channel, depends what happens. Probably some cooking challenges or testing some easy things that don't seem easy, but YouTubers do it anyway because it's entertaining and it saves us as viewers doing it anyway in case we blow up the kitchen and it makes mum angry. Yeah. Probably some random adventures with my twin sister Emily. Yeah. Your girl is a twin. Yeah. That's mainly because we can be an interesting bunch when we're combined. I don't know why I just did that. Because, you know, double trouble. Twin joke. Get over yourself, Jess. That wasn't funny. Anyway, you'll be witnessing a lot of things on this channel. <laughs> Hopefully not death. So, yeah, a little about me. I have a sister. I did mention we were twins, probably a couple of times. But yeah, she's my only sibling, but she's awesome. Haha, <laughs> I know. Cute. I've obviously got my parents who will probably make their occasional appearances. I have a cat. His name is Lucky, because he's lucky we found him. Nice one. My gorgeous cat. You look so dead, don't you? It's okay. Bye-byes. I might even have some friends come into the picture later on. Who knows? It's me. I'm full of surprises. So, introductions. They're bad. Okay. They're never good. They're awkward. They're cringy. And this is probably both. So, I thought... In order for this to be a semi-decent introduction video, I thought I would do... So, back ages ago, I asked for several of my friends... Thank you. I asked several of my friends to send me three words that they would use to describe me and why they chose them. Purely because I feel like I'm really bad and this is probably really bad at um, describing myself. And I thought that would be the best way to explain myself. So the first person, well I haven't read these since like last year about November. And I've been through a lot since and so I apologise if I start crying while reading these. But these are some things that my friends have said to me, and I think my mum might come up in it. I don't know. I don't think I sent her one of these. I feel bad. Sorry, mum. Yeah, okay, so the first person that, well, the first person that answered was my friend AJ. He replied of, crazy, funny, caring. Crazy because I've met you, funny because you always make me laugh, and caring because you have my back and so many others. Thanks, man. That's really nice. I do like to try and have everyone's back with everything. The next person is my good friend Carl. Carlos. He replied with pizza, 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 because pizza. Thanks. And then he corrected himself and he was like, Nah, I'm probs empathetic because you care and can relate to other people's emotions. Then probs enthusiastic because you seem to have that sort of fun attitude to things even if they are sometimes a bit boring and then maybe persistent because whenever you have something you want to do you will try your hardest to make them happen so to summarize empathetic enthusiastic and persistent nice and then my good friend jess just replied with i'd say funny kind and dedicated because you're good at making everyone laugh you're nice to everyone and you keep on top of your schoolwork while still caring for your family then she asked me why i was asking <laughs> And I was too ashamed to say, YouTube! So I said, it's for a project that I'm doing outside of school. Yes. I'm ashamed. <laughs> and I reply with, thanks you so much. <laughs> yes, English is my priority here. Yes, I did ask my mum. 
Okay, I was right. She replied with compassion, how you care for your family and friends is so wonderful to see. Your beauty, you're an amazing, beautiful lady inside and outside. Oh, thanks, Mum. My double chin says otherwise. Strength, I am so proud of you on how you handle yourself in bad situations and how you rise above them. Also, your sense of humour as you make me laugh. Sorry, that's four. Thanks, Mum. You're cute. Emma, who moved schools with me for year 12 as well, she replied with dedicated, funny, and kind. I value friends who make me laugh. And you are really kind to everyone around you, especially your sister. And you are a dedicated learner. You are also an honest friend, but that is also four words. That's okay. My friend Eloise, she replied with funny because once you get past your shyness, you're absolutely hilarious. Loving because you're so compassionate and caring about your friend. Talented because girl, you can paint. You can do arty things that I can never do and you can act and all that. You're just wonderful. Thanks Eloise. My friend Steph. Oh my god. God! Oh, she's the best. She replied with amazing, smart, and funny. You're always there for me, and you will help me in any way that you can. You're smart emotionally and logically, and you know right from wrong, and you can stand up for yourself. You're funny, as you will always, no matter what, make me laugh. And I love you. Awesome! Maddie! She also has a YouTube channel. She's awesome, and she's been bugging me about making mine for a long time. She replied with bubbly, charismatic, hilarious. Yes, I just read a big word. I am very proud of myself right now. Bubbly, because you're always the bubbliest person in the room. You're always making people laugh. Charismatic because, well, that explains itself. What does charismatic mean? I don't even know. Let's Google it. Charismatic, exercising a compelling charm which inspires devotion in others. Hilarious because you always make me laugh and even when I'm having a, a poopy day you crack jokes and you make me laugh or send me funny poop that brightens my day. Yes, I just replace swear words with the word poop. Don't judge me. Thanks, Maddie. This one's from my good friend Ella. Ella replied with, you are caring, you are humble, and you are wholesome. I think you're caring because you show empathy towards others as well as compassion and you want everyone to be doing their best and feeling happy so you do genuinely care about everyone. I think you're humble because you are a very talented person but you won't ever brag. You do pretty amazing things and don't expect recognition or admiration from others. When you do receive admiration you deny it because Maybe you don't think as highly of yourself as others do. I think you're wholesome because you are wholeheartedly yourself. You laugh, your passions, your friends. You let people know who you are, even if that means being vulnerable. You are excited to see people and share the positives of life. You've been through the negatives and understand some of the hard complexities of being human, and yet you still embrace the darkness and let it ex... ex and let it ex exude happiness. Is exude a word or is that just a typo? Don't judge me. Yes, it is an actual word. Discharge or discharge slowly and steadily. Okay, so learn from it and exude happiness. I think you're pretty cool. Aww. Thanks, man. I think you're awesome. Uh, my good mate Isaacs, he said, he literally replied with, oh God, that's impossible. I can give one word. Crazy. Okay, that's all I got to offer for today. I was expecting to cry during most of those, but I guess not. Now I need to think of a way to end this. Thank you for watching this so much. If you really liked this video, subscribe, because that'd be awesome. I have a new video coming out soon. Obviously something a bit more entertaining than this. I've got a whole load of ideas to share, but if you liked it, like it. This is weird. Please subscribe if you also enjoyed this and I'll give you more content that you hopefully enjoy more than this. And I will see you guys in the next video. Pizza Lord signing off.